Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be doing a review and giving y'all my absolute, my absolute honest opinion on this Revlon blow dryer that a lot of people have been raving about. So I'm gonna try it out and I'm gonna tell y'all if it worked for coarse hair because when I looked online, it was given, it works for straight hair. So, so we gonna see if this actually works for people, people with kinkier textures. Cause a lot of this stuff don't be for kinkier textures. So we gonna see if this actually works or not. If this is your first time here, then make sure you go and hit that subscribe button. I ain't got my watch on, but I'll wait. I'll wait until you you um, subscribe. Oh, that took longer than I expected. Make sure you are subscribed. Do not miss content. I come with new content every Thursday. And that's just what I'm doing right now. Um, I do intend on doing more, but for right now, we're gonna do Thursdays. And y'all gonna just jump right into this video because I don't wanna keep y'all too long just rambling on and talking about a whole bunch of crap that has nothing to do with the blow dryer. So I am going to give you guys my honest review. It's coming from a hairstylist, somebody that does um, blowouts. Also, I am actually on my way to the salon. Um, this is like seven something in the morning. <laughs> it's early in the morning. I done dropped, we done dropped the kids off at school and I just try, I'm just trying to hurry up and churn a video out before I have to be at the salon. So, so I had to go put my watch on y'all. Cause like I said, I'm actually on my way to the salon. So I'm fully getting dressed right now, okay? But I'm coming to y'all looking bold. I don't know what, I know y'all see how crazy I look. So I've already washed my hair, right? So I kept the plastic cap on because I wanted my hair to stay, um, I wanted to stay wet, I wanted to stay moist. So I did wash, and deep conditioned my hair last night and I just kept the plastic cap on just to uh, keep my hair wet. But like I said, it's already been washed. So we gonna see if this Revlon is gonna do what it do. So it's supposed to be one step. So you don't need to use a blow dryer. For me in a salon, I currently use a blow dryer and I use a brown brush. So they saying that this is supposed to be like a two in one so you can, um, so you won't have to use, essentially have to use the blow dryer and the round brush. But we gonna see how this, if this actually works and if it actually does what it say it's gonna do. So it has the oval design, so it's more of an oval which they say is supposed to create volume and curls the ends, which usually when it's kind of beveled like that, that does help it to create some type of um, fullness to it, but we'll see. Tangle free combination bristles to detangle, smooth, and create shine. So the bristles is supposed to create shine. It has a unique airflow and vents for faster drying and better coverage. And it has multiple heat settings. And then the professional swivel cord, which nobody gives a crap about. We just want to see if it works. We don't care about the swivel cord, okay? So let's see. We literally gonna toss that right there. <laughs> I'll get it when I'm done. So this is how it comes. And it has the little packaging to show you um, how it works, the multiple settings and all that kind of stuff. And yeah, it looks really cute so far. <laughs> So yeah, so far it looks cute, but we gonna see if it not only look cute, but actually work. Okay, we gonna see. We don't need a dryer that looks cute, but don't do nothing, okay? This is the settings right here for, uh, if you wanna do off, cool, low, or high. I'm gonna put it on high, just because. Mm. 
So my first take on it is it stinks bad as I don't know what. Now I know sometimes with um, with with uh, hair tools, it does kind of have a smell, especially like the dryers and uh, flat irons. They'll have like a smell when it's being used for the first time. So that's not alarming to me. It just stinks bad. with this blow dryer and coming from a hairstylist that says a lot because I've been through a lot of blow dryers in the last six seven years so this dryer I'm gonna have to definitely give it a, a, a absolute 10 um, it blow dried my hair really good I love how I love how soft this is made my hair like the softness is what does it for me so The way I feel about this blow dryer, y'all. My take on this blow dryer is that it is a freaking lifesaver. I am so in love with... I'm sorry, y'all. I have a visitor that wants to speak, obviously. He's trying to make his, his, uh, his grand appearance. <laughs> Hold on. This is Ace. He's our new puppy. We've had him since Christmas. But he wanted to say hi to y'all because... He's right here, like literally in my way, trying to be seen. So I figure I'll let y'all see him real quick. Hey Ace, look, Ace, say hi. <laughs> I'm saying say hi, like you can actually say hi. Okay guys, if I was to just use a round brush and a blow dryer, my hair can get straight, but not as straight as this thing got my hair. I don't know what they got in here, some little ionic something to, smooth out the hair but oh my god the way my hair feels I'm like I can literally wear my hair like this without even have to straighten it like literally this is without any straight straightening comb this is without any flat iron none of that for this blow dryer to do this I am freaking impressed I am impressed no lie I will definitely be using this in the salon um and yeah, I would recommend you guys buying this. It This definitely just saved me a lot of time on top of everything else. It only took me 10 minutes to blow dry my hair. To blow dry my hair in under 10 minutes, that is very impressive. Like I said, it was gliding through my hair. I put a little bit of oil in it. My hair was wet. I didn't have any other products in my hair besides the water and the oil. And I'm loving it. I'm lo um, if you are interested in purchasing this Revlon, um, blow dryer then the link will be down in the description box below I did purchase this on Amazon and like I said this is a definite must purchase must purchase ASAP okay because this did what it's supposed to do I do apologize for abandoning my channel for over a year I am back and I will try to be as consistent as possible scratch that not try I am going to be consistent on my channel no matter what, okay? I'm gonna be consistent, just point blank period. I need to just say that, put that out there. Bam, that's it. But if you guys are interested in seeing where I've been over the year, why I haven't been on my channel, what I've been up to, what's been up, what, what, what what's going on, <laughs> then you guys um, comment down below that y'all wanna see that video and I will upload that video but I need to get enough people that's interested otherwise I'm gonna feel like what's the use of posting it if nobody want to see it anyway then I might as well not post it but anyway please leave down below 
future videos you are interested in seeing so I can post that for y'all. But um, if you guys are on Instagram, go and follow me on Instagram at justmarie underscore hair studio. Make sure you're following me on Instagram because I am consistent all the time on there and I post things all the time about my family, um, what I'm doing in the salon, and just my day to day is always on my Instagram story. So if you guys are interested in just knowing a little bit more about me, then go and follow me on Instagram. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next Thursday. Bye.